on one island, I have heard about an incredible technique, so fantastic sounding, I can't believe it's true. I have to say, this is probably the strangest kind of fishing preparation I've had to do. James is one of only two surviving men on this group of islands who know how to do this. He has never before shown this to an outsider. This, this spider, he bite? Yes. He bites oh. this one? Quite a little. Right. This technique uses no hook. Instead, we're collecting a spider's web. This spider for you. Right. Very good. Full tight. Okay. Ah. Fish, ready. Ready, ready, ready for fishing now. Yeah. And there's no rod. Instead, we'll be using this elaborate handmade kite, stitched together from banana leaves. James may be willing to share his secrets, but I'm the apprentice here, so I'll be doing the paddling. The movement of the kite causes the web to skip temptingly across the water. We are after needlefish. They hunt small fish near the surface and can jump out of the water at speeds of nearly 40 miles per hour. The theory is that the needlefish's teeth act as the hook, getting tangled in the fine sticky mesh of the spider's web. The kite is up in the air, but getting it up is just the, the beginning of it. What we've got to do once it is in the air is get our position, speed, direction correct so that the lure just skims across the surface without swinging around in the air or being too deep below, dragging along. I feel privileged to witness a centuries-old technique that only a handful of men have mastered, and sadness to see it come to the very end of its time. Is that a fish? Yeah, we're going to fish, we're going to fish. That's very strong, yeah? No, that, no not, not come off. Absolutely caught, cool, that is. Looks like the wind has gone, actually, but my goodness, when, when the conditions are right, when you get this working, it's just so ingenious, it's so amazing, very, very clever. And to be part of it, to actually catch a fish without a hook, without a rod, just a bit of spider's web and a kite, you know, I'm not sure, if you just told people about that, I'm not sure if they'd believe you.